Good morning, everyone. Meteorologist Michelle Muscatello here. We've uh, started a new month, a month that has a lot of great things with it. I love the month of May. It can start off a little turbulent like we're seeing this next few days with unsettled and cool conditions, but on average, we get a lot of spring warmth in here. By the end of the month, the average temperature up to 73. We drop down our rainfall amounts on average about three and a half inches. It's one of our drier months of the year in southern New England, or can be at least. And then as far as daylight goes, we add about another hour of it over the course of the month. Today, Today, we're going to be seeing a lot of clouds around throughout the day. We've had a couple of sprinkles and very light showers that have come through this morning. Uh, we're tracking high pressure still in control, but an approaching warm front bringing the wet weather to parts of New England for today. That front gets a little bit closer to us, and our rain chances start to go up again during the uh, overnight hours tonight. So 12:30 this afternoon, just a lot of clouds and cool conditions for us. We will see the risk of some drizzle and some showers at the coastline by the end of the evening and then overnight tonight some scattered lighter showers. Thursday morning starts off overcast, dreary and cool. Can't rule out a shower on Thursday, but there'll be some dry time too. It's a chilly day, highs only in the lower 50s and on Friday, we're in the mid 50s with some off and on showers. Let's talk about the weekend. So here we are Friday night, that frontal system going to try to work its way across New England. If it can push offshore by Saturday morning, some drier air will try to work in. So Saturday right now is looking like the better half of the weekend. Best part of the weekend, probably Saturday afternoon. That's the time frame I feel most confident in right now of some storm-free weather. Sunday, here comes another wave of low pressure, another round of rainfall. The forecast right now brings that right into southern New England with some widespread rainfall Sunday. If we can get this system to track further offshore, we've got a chance at some drier weather on Sundays. Definitely not a lock yet, so check back in with us for updates.